group. Okay, so uh, right, it was a few days ago now, so it's day 71. So it was uh, two or three days ago, maybe four, three or four days ago. Um, right, so as we were coming back down into the astral plane, as oh, part of, the phys of this mental tree, so I started to get. Um, well, I had enough of vision of. It seemed to be about five um, streams. I uh, say that they're streams um, of symbols. Now they were sim symbols similar to tarot cards. That sort of level of complexity. Um, some of them were more simple than others, but they were basically symbolic things. But they were more. Um, they weren't tarot cards, but they were very like them, similar to them. Um, and there were these streams, like moving relatively slowly, so you could stop and focus on them. And I was aware that, that they were all, well, the, more or less the conclusion I've come to is that they were, they were somehow connected to these five pathways that lead up the tree from the sun sphere. Uh, so I think that would be the, um, the Hanged Man, Justice, uh, the High Priestess, the Emperor, and the Hermit. Um, right, so I saw this um, video, and it was, I think it was a video, and uh, someone talking about this exercise you could do where you visualized uh, five doorways and the different colored doorways and each doorway had a different kind of um, pathway like, or destiny um, behind it and you could do this exercise where you, you meditated and you would like choose which of these door doorways most interested you you know and help you know was the right one for you so um, I think there's an aspect of this where you can um, It seemed to be relevant to what I was this work anyway. The, what, the reason I saw this at this particular time, you know, on the astral plane, we're connecting with this um, sun sphere, and there's all these different pathways, and like five different pathways going up and three going down. So it's like the eightfold path in a sense. Um, okay, so you've got these like five doorways. Or these five streams that you can observe you can lean in to the astral plane from here and observe these different um, uh, pathways the doorways fates destinies and with all these different things going on and you can read them and it will, it will tell you what's going on in, if, you know if you go you know what sort of life you will end up in if you, if you follow this particular destiny so in theory you can like um, constantly look you can you pay attention to what's going on on all five different streams um, and then act accordingly and move from one to the other oh yeah that's the other thing I could easily have not got this like uh, right so what you can do is you can make connections between uh, little symbols and scenes on one stream to other streams and, and actually go into them because they're, 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 in a sense they're, they're like tarot cards so you can enter them like you can tarot cards they're like doorways into different worlds you know and they can connect because it's the astral plane and you're looking at it from the mental plane it's, it funnels down into the physical plane right so there's like these different alternate realities so then you can um, make connections between one to the other these different things that you see oh that interests me that interests me I'll make a connection between this thing and this thing right this is what's going on in the outside world. This is the mental plane and how it works, connects to the physical plane. <sighs> okay, now I'll leave that to stew for a little while. The other thing about this uh, chakra, um, when we when we finish all five months connected with uh, this work, it's going to be it's going to be we're going to finish on the physical plane again to sort of, you know, finish the. Uh, circle close the circle so to speak 
what will happen is we'll, we will, uh, I think we'll start the physical month on the, on the, the base chakra, uh, the, the, the ground, and go up, and then down, and then up again. So this is the one, this is the last one we will finish on. Is that right? <laughs> I think it's right. It's right. So, uh, so this is, whilst we're here now, uh, on day 71, we're going back up the uh, mental tree, um, and then we're going to, hang on a minute, then we're going to come back down again, yeah. <laughs> then we're going to go onto the air tree, spiritual tree, but uh, this chakra is the, the, the one we're actually going to finish on. It's going to be the end of, of the, the all five months. We, we're going to end here, so it's something to bear in mind. And it's also Zion, you know, so we should be like, at the end of the five months, like, we're nearly halfway through now, we're just coming up to half, the halfway mark, but at the end of five months, we should just be like, that's where we're going to finish. <laughs> On, in Zion, like, so, uh, get ready for this, prepare for this, um, another 16 days of meditation, in the sphere of severity, Maybe integrate some uh, martial arts with that. Um, you could do um, bear hearts, uh, lower banishing ritual of the pentagram, and his, his stuff, the other you know stuff, the magical armor, and that that will help you get a lot more work done. I imagine in, in whilst you're doing all this stuff, you can go and stay in the dojo, dojo, and do some stuff there, meditation, but you know, you can talk to people here, you know, and you can, you know, you can find people that are guides. Be careful about trusting everyone. Make sure that you're really grounded when you start talking to these people and you, you've got your, your mental plane going on, your astral plane going on and your physical plane going on all in harmony, working before you start trusting people or going off outside of the, the, the dojo. But um, I would suggest use the dojo as a base for meditation for the next 16, well, for these upcoming 16 days and during that time you know get to know people here and um, also you know integrate it with the physical plane and and your astral plane because um, you know if people are walking around and they're in these four worlds all the time so there are going to be people walking around that are going to be able to connect to these levels and you're going to communicate with them and it'll be like you're in Zion with these people so um, Get start getting this sort of stuff around in our head as well at the moment. 